In the vast universe of Star Trek, few episodes resonate as deeply with the human condition as the measure of a man. This episode isn't just about a legal hearing on a starship, it's a profound examination of what it means to be a person, the ethics of technology, and the struggles against prejudice and discrimination. Hello and welcome back to another Star Trek is Life. In this episode from Season 2 of The Next Generation, the fate of Lieutenant Commander Data, the Enterprise's android officer, hangs in the balance. Starfleet wants to dismantle Data to study him, but Captain Picard argues that Data has the right to choose his own fate. What unfolds is a courtroom drama that goes far beyond the simple question of ownership, delving into the essence of personhood and the rights of sentient beings. At the heart of this episode is the question of personhood. Can an artificial being like Data be considered a person, deserving of rights, or is he merely property, a tool to be used and discarded by Starfleet? This debate isn't just science fiction, it's a reflection of real-world issues we face today, as artificial intelligence becomes increasingly sophisticated. As AI continues to evolve, we must ask ourselves, what criteria define personhood, and who gets to decide? Captain Picard's defense draws a stark comparison between Data's situation and slavery. He argues that denying Data the right to choose is akin to reducing him to a mere object, stripping him of his autonomy. This raises powerful questions about how we, as a society, treat those who are different. Throughout history, entire groups have been marginalized and denied their basic rights, and this episode serves as a reminder of the dangers of such dehumanization. The ethical implications of technology are another major theme in the measure of a man. If we are to create a sentient being, do we have the right to control it, or do we have a responsibility to treat it as an equal? The episode challenges us to consider the consequences of our technological advancements. Just because we can create something doesn't mean we have the right to exploit it. This is a lesson that's increasingly relevant as we develop more advanced AI and robotics. Throughout the next generation, Data faces prejudice because of his artificial nature. In the measure of a man, his discrimination is laid bare as he's treated less than a human. This reflects broader societal issues about how we view and treat those who are different from us, whether due to race, gender, or in this case, the nature of their existence. The episode challenges us to confront our own biases and work toward a more inclusive and accepting society. The episode also anticipates future legal and moral debates about the status of AI. As artificial intelligence becomes more integrated into our lives, we'll need to decide how to legally classify these entities. Are they merely tools or do they deserve the same rights as humans? The Measure of a Man serves as an early exploration of these issues, urging us to think carefully about the future we are creating. So, what does The Measure of a Man teach us? Beyond the courtroom drama, it's a powerful commentary on personhood, autonomy, and the ethics of technology. It challenges us to think critically about our responsibilities as creators and as a society. As we move forward in this rapidly evolving world, let's remember the lessons of this episode. To be thoughtful, to be ethical, and to be empathetic. Because these are the values that will guide us toward a more just and equitable future. Thank you for your time and for listening to Star Trek is Life.